Hello guys, and welcome back! Where we last left off, I'm helping Ed deal with his fears. And I got a little plastic watch. I'm just going back quickly to go get another weapon. So, I'll take another 2x4. Really trying to save that machete. But yeah, I'll lead Ed out and do a survey mission and see about the strange transmissions with the army. So, let's go! Ed, you, you're coming! You're an even worse shot than me. <laughs> anyway, let's uh, let's get going, Ed. So um, what what are we doing out here exactly? Just taking care of some business. Figured pitching in might make you feel better. I see something. Okay, there's an infestation like in the toilets. I'll have to deal with that at some okay. point, I imagine. Now we're gonna kill some zombies the old-fashioned way. To your left. Well, uh, even though me and Ed did this like five minutes ago, well not five minutes ago, like two parts ago, he needs to do it again because he's scared. I didn't even know you could climb out of those windows. Apparently you can though. <laughs> See? Oh, man, Isn't this fun? Fucked royally. Hey, zombies! Oh, I, I mean I saw you, I didn't think you could get him. Oh, get me. Nice work. Things are looking up already. Thank you. Well, go ahead. Lead the way. Let's roll. Okay, feels absolutely better now. So that worked. Uh, that's how you do with your fears, folks. You go and kill a few people. Or zombies in this case. I'll just quickly loot the area. And then throw bed back on. In fact, I'll do the infestation while I still have bed. That'll be fun. Uh, wrench... Industrial wrench and cutting machine blade. I'll take the nah. the industrial wrench, I guess. Uh, yeah. Um, I'll go in the bloody Marcus mobile, as this is. I really like this car for some reason. It's the one I picked up at the farm, and it's amazing. I'm surprised it lasted this long. But yeah, I'll, I'll just go. Yes, anything's possible. Look, kill this infestation over here. Everybody's scared. Just don't do anything stupid, okay? Yeah. O okay, sure. Why is that a big dude? No, that's just that's just a police man, zombie. And that's a horde. That's a horde running towards us. I've dealt with hordes before without using a car. Let's go. Go through. Go around. Take that! That didn't kill nearly as many as I thought, but it actually killed quite a few. It's not nearly as many as I thought. Probably shouldn't be using the Wilkinson's private reserve, though. That's actually rare, I imagine. Don't let it get up. Well, I never. Oh, I should probably. I don't know how I'm gonna deal with that cop. I don't know how tough they are in comparison to normal zombies. So please. Oh, let go of it. They're actually not that tough. I don't know why they're bringing, given like a special bigger circle. Could be trouble on the left. I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't know what I'm talking about, alright? I'm just going with it. There's a zombie here. Hey. <laughs> Take that. Oh, that was, yeah, that was incredible. Let me just, uh... <laughs> it's just, it's amazing. You just destroy them. Alright, do I have to be the one? Can I reload? Right. Okay, that is dealt with one right at the door. Take this! Just constant pushing so I don't have to actually use the durability. At least I don't think I use the durability. Ah. Right, I think we're doing well here. I'm so glad Ed came voluntarily and I didn't need to use any of my influence here. Uh, would you please deal that? See, this is just making it feel even better. That's what I feel it is. Although it says there's like a big zombie around and I don't see them. Where's this big zombie? Wait, can I? Oh my god, can I finally do a stealth kill after so long? No, no. Can't do a stealth kill. 
Where's this zombie? Around here? He might be in this supply closet, actually. You in here? You're not in here. Why can't I gotta clear this out? Where are you? This zombie is non existent. Keep an eye on our six. I'll find the zombie. I will. I will find this goddamn zombie. I didn't kill all these zombies for no reason. Is he inside one of these? Can I open these? I don't think I can open these. All the zombies are dead. I just need to kill this big zombie. Is he on the roof? Can he be on the roof? Is that a fin that can happen? No. No, it isn't. We're just on a roof now. Right, well... Oh, wait. Found him. There's apparently... We'll be on him soon if we keep going this way. Where... What are you... He was in there? When we in there? Uh, that should do it. it doesn't make sense. We was in here. How did he... How? Uh, just how. Whatever. Whatever. I'm just gonna go home. Zombie activity, three o'clock. Don't care, Ed. Just, let's just go home before I give up. I can deal with looking out on the stuff and the fins and... Yeah, whatever. Whatever. Just take him home. Drop him off. Hope you feel better now, Ed. Look, uh, I'll think about what you said. Good. Is it still an issue of morale, or are we, we cool? We're cool? We're cool. Crisis averted. Uh, I will deliver this industrial wrench, because I do not need it. And I should probably swap. I should really swap. Marcus is tired. I like to give him a break. Ed is tired, but she isn't tired, so... There we go. Swap to her, she can look around, and if the army signal is still prevalent, I'll deal with that. I imagine he's waiting for me to talk about moving house, but I'm actually content being here. Alright, so... Army activity, and a lookout. So, look out first. Now that's a Marcus mobile. I can't use it unless Marcus is here. That's a rule I'm gonna make. Only Marcus can use that vehicle. Otherwise, she has to use every other vehicle. And maybe, you know, this might actually work better if I'm using my, because she is actually part of the military. So it might actually work out. Might. But yeah, uh, I'll just go do this survey. This game is actually really good. Now that I finally got to grips with it, I'm actually really enjoying this game. Well, I should probably get on with the main missions, because I, I... Again, I've been trying to build up the, you know, the whole survivor group. But I think, uh, I think I'm doing pretty well here. Okay. Made it. Gonna look around now. What else is left? That house there, the screamer. See something? Looks like an infestation. What else is around? What am I missing? There is a juggernaut. Thankfully, he's not going anywhere near us. He's going to do his own thing. Uh, is that it? What am I missing? Oh, there. It's and a zombie down. horde. Cool. I haven't seen that before. Who goes down on one side? I, I thought that... I thought to go down on both. That's really... Really dangerous. God. Anyway, I'll go deal with this army... Uh, transmission and... Uh, yeah, we'll see what, what happens there. I've been told not to trust the military, though, so I'm very wary. Although, if I bring someone, they'll probably just not bother. We might be able to hold off another attack. A few more outposts would give us more of a safety net. 
I know, you keep you keep telling me this. And I'm not gonna do it. Can't force me. Alright, hello. Oh, God, what's gonna happen here? This is bullshit. We're just trying to survive out here. You can't kill us for that. Uncle Sam would seem to disagree with you there. Our orders are to evict squatters with lethal force if they resist. You resisted, so... Just let us go. I, I got kids, man. And yet you're out here, violating quarantine, unlawfully occupying people's homes. Great parenting. Look, we, we're sorry, right? We're just trying to get by, same as everybody. <sighs> you got 30 seconds to get out of my sight. 30, 29, 28, 27, 26. <sighs> Jesus. This is about the biggest crock of horse shit ever. We're done here, Sergeant. Tell your men to prep for evac and RTB. Yes, ma'am. Why don't you make yourself useful and go babysit those two? Find the survivor? Right, well... <laughs> this could have turned out far worse. I'm just gonna leave those people who nearly did a execution alone. I'm gonna go... Get the people. I'm out of here. Bye. I've stole this tariff car, by the way. Please don't judge me. I'm off. We. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Right. The... They had to be in the buildings with the hordes next to it and all the zombies. <laughs> God's sake. She was far better shot than I ever was. Right. <laughs> Oh god, I'm getting- I'm getting killed very, very rapidly. Get off. Get off. Get back in the car. I nearly got my absolute ass kicked there. Uh, just- I'll just use the police car. I'm happy. I'm glad I did that. <laughs> not try to fight them anymore. I nearly got killed. This is not Marcus. How are they in here? Anybody home? No. Time to move on. Let me just top over this fence. Are they in the for sale house? Anybody home? They are not, in fact, in the for sale house. In fact, they could be upstairs. Are they upstairs? Hello? Hello? Anyone? Time to move on. Nope. Waste time. Although there's a zombie downstairs, but I'm gonna choose to ignore that. It is the police officer. Right, well, they're only in the construction building place. That is the official tour. I don't know why I said it there. Yeah, that's his name. Whatever. Uh, you here? Hello? Oh, hey. I got these assholes. <laughs> He's talking to them? What you want? Why don't you come with me? We've got room. Really? My God, thank you. Thought for sure we were gonna die out here. Um, where's the other one? Right, I would take you back, but I want my police car, so... We'll, uh, we'll go do that. Looks like trouble up ahead there. Do you wanna do that? You, you wanna do that? Please go do that. Thanks. Hey, we'll have 13 survivors. I don't know if we can support 13 survivors. We'll see. Might need to use extra space for a dorm. Although, can I put a, them in the outposts? That's... That's fine. Can I ship those people to look after the outposts? I'll find out. I'll find out. In any case, let's uh, take these people home. Time to alert. It does, doesn't matter. What did those soldiers want, anyways? Beats the hell out of me. They just showed up, dragged us out onto the street, and sent in those guys in hazmat suits. Started taking a bunch of samples and what the hell? talking about infection vectors and a bunch of shit I didn't understand. I think that woman was in charge, Captain Montresor or something. Not like she even looked at us. That's it, right up there. Make yourselves at home. Thanks. You don't know what this means to us. Right, well, there's two ferals just running around. And yeah, I should probably establish another outpost somewhere.
Probably in that house I said I would. Especially since we're getting a bit of a crowded here. Anyway, uh, we saved two more people. I'm happy. Alright. Are we actually overcrowded? That's the question. I don't know. I'll, uh... I'll actually establish an outpost here in this house, if I can. The one right next door. Very quickly, just gonna <laughs> just set up another outpost right here. I could use some food. Could you? Oh, right. You're tired. Sorry, my commentary's going down. I'm I'm uh just trying to kill zombies and kick ass. Can only do one at a time, apparently. In fact, I'll hold the search. I just want to set up an outpost here. Do I even need to search the house if I make an outpost? Is that the thing that I need to do? Okay, that's the front door. Should probably close that. Better do one more sweep. Make sure everything's clear. Yeah, it's not clear. There's a zombie right here. Confirmed. Where's that free here? Okay, so I can set up an outpost here then. Maybe later. Maybe later. You must fully search the location before establishing an outpost here. Right. So I need to actually take all this back. Okay, okay, well. I'll just extend this part, take all the for all the stuff in the car outside, I guess. It's crutch. Nice. <laughs> yeah, that was not that was not entirely smart, but I'll throw everything I can in here. Like this crutch. Maybe I'll actually come back to doing the outposts, because uh, it might take a while to transport everything. Yeah, you know what, I'll, I'll come back. Next time in State of Decay, I will make the outposts here. But until then, I'll, uh, I'll actually get back to the, the base. I'll leave the car outside, because I'll probably need it at some point. But yes, thanks for watching, folks. Hope you enjoyed. I uh, hope I'm doing right here, because I hope I am. But yeah, thanks for watching, folks. And I will see you next time, when we continue to live in the state of decay. So, thanks for watching, and I'll see you then. Later.